impacting Latino and black communities. Times haven't been easy since Chicago public schools were closed. Times haven't been easy since the generations before mine settled in Chicago, since discriminatory housing policies created Chicago to be a city of isolated and segregated racio-ethnic neighborhoods. and stand with our people, stand with our allies, and just show that this is, people care, this is an issue, this is not going anywhere, and it needs to be resolved. Tell me what democracy looks like! This is what democracy looks like! Tell me what democracy looks like! This is what democracy looks like! Tell me what democracy looks like! Tell me what democracy looks like! You know, we've been out for pretty much the whole week. You know, I was out on Saturday, and I figured rather than just being another body, I'd uh, take my van out and, uh, you know, pack it full of supplies and, you know, just help out. I love being black! I love being black! We're still out here because we haven't achieved change yet. We're still fighting for our black brothers and sisters. What we saw that sparked these protests was the lynching of George Floyd. We are out here not only seeking the conviction of all four cops, we want to see the indictment and the conviction of Breonna Taylor's killers. We should be celebrating her 27th birthday, but instead we had a funeral for her. to be able to recognize when you are a part of the problem and learn and change. are going to be out here for a really long time. No justice! No peace! No justice! No peace! No racist ass police! No justice! No peace! No racist ass police! We are in the city that got the murderer of Laquan McDonald convicted. 16 shots! 16 shots! 16 shots! people on camera like that's okay and it shouldn't be you know I'm a nurse I'm taking care of the protesters and the police and whoever is hurt so you know I, I, I don't go for violence but somebody life got taken so until they can understand that we gonna keep doing what we do when we stand in solidarity with the most oppressed people in this country we are standing up to the oppressive systems that hold us all down we must first stand as allies with Black Lives Matter for joy, for peace, for existence. When I say black lives, you say matter. Black lives! Black lives! Black lives! Black lives!
a bus when I was born, project scene backdrop, beer bottle from crack rocks, front door from padlocks, she got the criminals, and she got the bad guys.